I haven't had this good a time in ages. That's true. You know this one. A little apple skipping down the path. Plough,
You forget who you're dealing with, Commandant. You must think me an idiot. I cannot help myself. You take guardsmen off the streets to guard carpets, fabrics and spices pilfered from merchants. Do you have any grasp of the responsibility that rests with you? Don't teach an old man to piss, sorceress. I've ruled Flotsam for years. Flotsam is ruled by a fear of your death. That fear rules even you. I've made my demands perfectly clear. Like a crying babe deprived of its rattle. In time, Commandant, they'll hang you by the neck from a roadside tree like a regular bandit. And rightly so, for you're no better. Your time will come too, sorceress. They'll pile kindling at your feet. Enough. Fear has confused you. Think over what I said and give your answer before it's too late. Nothing better than a fireside feast. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts. Didn't like him from the start. Laredo's storing valuable gifts from the merchants right here. He may be expecting Yorvith to attack. I overheard the Commandant talking to Sheila. I couldn't pinpoint the topic of their conversation, but it seems to me he's angling for something. We'll see what he has to say. <laughs> Add flour into the mix and it doesn't get any better. Luckily, the Commandant's provided it all. True. <laughs> Come here, lad. Your uncle's got a storm. Go in. They await you. Where are we to go? I'd hardly call this a hut. You. I mean you, sir, cannot enter. We've been ordered to let in the Witcher, but no one else. Son of a bitch. Fine. He wants to play hard, will. I don't want any trouble. I'll call for... No need. Tell Lorito I got them. See you, Roach. Here to see the Commandant. We have business to discuss. Good luck. He's in a foul mood.
Go in. Where are we to go? I'll you. I'm son of a. I don't want any. No need. See you. Everything's where it should be. Did you, uh. prove it to me? For ten iron. No passage. Well, not a long one. Here to see the Commandant. We have business to discuss. Good luck. Why? We'll talk another time, and definitely elsewhere. Entry only on the Commandant's express orders. Off you go. Finally. Finally! They didn't want to let me in while the sorceress was here. Did you see her? Made up like a whore on parade day. They think they can do anything, those sorceresses. I heard what happened in Temeria. You know your name's on a warrant. It's unfortunate, though nothing that should impede our dealings. See, I'm the law round here. And the law needs to know what the legendary White Wolf's doing in this cesspit. I'm looking for the man responsible for Foltest's death. Here? I know the Scoyatel had a hand in it too. It's their trail I followed to Flotsam. Lucky you found Bernard Laredo then. If you're telling the truth, your vest has got raw blood on his hands. I can help you find him. What about Vernon Roach? Why didn't you let him in? Roach? Know the aura that surrounds him? Men like him act first and think later. And when they act, almost inevitably innocent blood flows. I trust you're on our side. Whose side is that? That of the people of Flotsam, of course. Terrorized by the elven b My enemy's enemy is my friend. We barely escaped with our lives the last time we ran into Yorvith. Damn squirrels draw ever nearer. What about the elves and dwarves in the trading post? The smiths, peddlers, and hunters? They eat with you, sleep among you. Whose side are they on? Hell if I know. That's my point, Witcher. When you fight for survival, you need to be sure who your friends are. The non-humans in Flotsam, sure. They eat, fuck, shit among us. But when Yorveth sounds the battle horns, who knows what they'll do. I'm surprised they haven't turned on you already. How so? The town guards treat non-humans like shit. Frankly, I don't know what keeps them here. I'll tell you what, Geralt. The hunger they'd face in the forest. But I grant you, those acts of, uh, insubordination need to be stopped. Soldiers are simple men. When you see your mate die, a scoyatel arrow in his throat, it's hard to look favorable at the elf who sells your wife colored kerchiefs. You're a witcher. Your job is to protect the simpletons from monsters. I protect them from the danger that lurks amongst the trees. I see where this is going. Yorvik's no better than a monster that attacks those who go out to gather kindling. Matter of fact, he's worse. He's smarter and crueler. How do we get him? I don't want you to kill him. Even you don't have a hope against his entire force. I have an idea, but I'd rather not go into it now. The squirrels are up to something. Every night their scouts come closer. I suspect they plan to attack the barge moored in the port. What's on the barge? You mean who? 
bandits, murderers, rapists, on their way to the dungeons at Drakenborg. As soon as their infamous leader joins them, the cherry on the cake and Bernard Lorito's crown trophy. Couldn't have put it better myself. As long as Yorveth remains free, humans, elves, and dwarves will live alongside each other in deep distrust. I've got to learn what the pointy-eared rat is planning. How am I supposed to get that information? <laughs> you underestimate me, Witcher. True, I have my prejudices, but I'm not blinded by them. Take your friend Zoltan, for instance. He contacted Yorveth. How can Zoltan help if he can't go outside the walls? <laughs> step by step, Geralt. That's how you build trust. You could start by tending to a problem we have. A beast. The Karen has blocked all boat traffic. I'm losing tolls. That is, um, the trading post is losing revenue. Kill the Karen, and I'll declare your friends acquitted of their crimes. Then Zoltan can take you to see Yorveth. I'm a witcher. I don't work for free. Of course you don't. Help us capture the Scoyatel commander, and you'll be rewarded generously, straight from the trading post's treasury. I'll see what I can find out. Though you stir up storms wherever you go, I actually believe you'll bring peace to Flotsam. Don't disappoint this town, Geralt. Farewell.
Any news for me? I guess you're fine. He's stubborn, it's true. But he's met his match. And I'm not about to leave Flotsam to the same fate as the other towns and villages the Scoyatella burnt to the ground. The citizens of Flotsam owe the elves nothing. They built their homes and workshops with their own hands in the wilderness, not on the ruins of an elven town. If need be, we'll remind the Long Ears where they belong. You've got a heap of soldiers for such a small trading post. Bandits swarm to trading routes like flies to shit. Only troops can guarantee some order here. We're the last Temerian outpost in this area, and we'll not give in to a bunch of elves. Entry only on the Commandant's Express orders. Off you go. No passage. Nothing better than a fireside feast. <laughs> Except a fireside feast with copious amounts of liquor. <laughs> Luckily, the commandant's provided it all. Squirrels. I'd put them in their place. You'd all talk. Prove it. I doubt anyone would stop you. We're too soft on them, that's the problem. Soldiers are bored. The garrison's thinning. <laughs> now you're talking. We don't need to look for the Scoyatel. Cut the rebel down one by one and we'll finally have peace. You'd go after the women? Then relish killing the elven brats? So? The brats turn into squirrels. And once the women are gone, there'll be no more brats. Stop talking bollocks or I'll go.
Blowing squirrels. I'd put them in their place. You don't talk. Prove it. I don't. We're too soft on them, that's the problem. Soldiers are bored. They say witches are talking. We don't need to look for the sky itself. You know that. Cut the rebel down one by one, and we'll finally have to Don't you traipse around here. Don't forget your blade. Want your face smashed? <laughs> About what, new boy? Maybe we ought to try some oh, honest oh, work from time trouble. to time. New boy, my friend will now tell you something very important. <coughs> Lads, I was thinking. About what, new boy? Maybe we ought to try some honest work from time to time. New boy, my friend will now tell you something very important. Uh -oh. Listen carefully and trouble. take it to heart. Yeah, what? Never, ever say that again.
Disperse! Go home! Something's troubling me. Let's see here. What does a bloody witcher actually eat? Uh, mushrooms? Spuds. Why spuds? Because he's a human like us. He sweats, he bleeds.
What do you want? Get the fuck out! Rose. Wait till he drops his fucking guard!
you lost. Punches lights. for a game. Kidneys! Thank you. 
Arthur's fault as they killed Spectacled. Wasn't he the one who always wanted us to call him Dad? No, I've seen that one today. Greetings. What can I get you, fine lad? What do you think of the Commandant? Mr. Laredo is a great man. A great man. He looks after us, helping like. Taxes are just as they should be. We're all pleased he governs the trading post and we're all perfectly happy here. Excellent. You're a model citizen. I'll be sure to inform the Commandant. Bah! Do I need publicity? I'm a humble woman. I know what's good for me. The readers are leading. What do you think of the- Mr. Taxes- What do you talk- That's foolishness, Master Witcher. Shouldn't say that. Shouldn't bad my- You fear him that much? Don't you provoke me. Beat it. What do you think of the- Mr. Laredo is a great- Taxes are just- Excellent. Bye. Ever heard of doing it, witch and trigger style? Yet another witcher. Care for a little... <laughs> Remind me, which one was this fault as they killed? Yet another witch. Punch his lights out! Enjoy. May it be our last. This shit. <laughs> out. <coughs> Spitty <laughs> <dead. laughs> I mean, I hope. It... What's going on here? Competition, brother. With the port closed, we'll care to take part. What are the rules? The contenders put their coin down. Winner takes all. The fighting rule. Drop your opponent and make sure he stays down. Complicated. So, are you fighting, brother? Oh, yeah. He's a fresher like... So, what... I'm ready. Gentlemen, let the dance begin. Wouldn't want to get on your bad side. Up for another, brother. Some other time. Left hook! Watch out for the left hook! I pledge to make it off of Seems even the gods cannot prevail on Punches lights out! 
Kato. Are you fighting, brother? What are the rules? The contender? The fighting. Drop your complicated. So? Some of Left hook! Oh, watch out for the left hook! So? Who's up next? Core brand strange. There's everything. Show us. So what? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let the dance begin. Kick the plowing bastard! Hey, champ! What? I can tell you're a serious contender. Far too good for this drunken riffraff. Believe you me, I know what I'm talking about. So? I don't know you. They call me King Ziggy, because I pay like a king. If you want a taste of fame and riches, look for me by the inn in the evenings. I'll take you to the right place. That was fucking poet! Up for another, brother. Some of the time. Even the gods cannot prevail in this blockade. Punches! So? Who's up next? I knew you'd end up fighting each other. Who's that? Tidy Tib. The bastard eats honey straight from the hive. Drinks for four, and some say he can hang a bucket full of water from his cock. You better get a solid coin pouch ready. So, what'll it? I'm ready. Gentlemen, let the dance begin. Enjoy your meal. May it be our last one in this shit. <laughs> I mean, I hope we can leave soon. By the gods, forest In the kidneys! Wait till he drops his fucking guard! 
Want to get on your bad side? Congratulations! You dropped some of the toughest bro. Well done! Tournament's over! Left hook! Watch out for the left hook! <laughs> Something's troubling me. Let's hear it. What does a bloody witcher actually eat? Uh, mushrooms? Spuds? Why nice spuds? Because he's a human like us. He sweats, he bleeds. What? Smart well ups, eh? I'm bored the boys stiff. pull punching tricks, that's how they get their kicks. But hear me when I say, an orange's a tiny price to pay. Who does King Ziggy behold? Given any thought to my proposal? Give me the details. Only once you've made your mind up, my f For now, you'll have to make do with the l Or you can go on waste. What do you say? I'm ready. I'll explain on- Something's troubling me. Spit it out. Know what Flotsam's famous for? Nothing. You're wrong there. There are only two towns worth visiting in the Pontar Valley. Pondar, famous for having the most beautiful halls in the north, and Flotsam, for having the best fist fighting scene. Who organizes these fights? Officially, no one. But look hard and you'll be surprised what you can find. It's a vibrant scene with winners and losers of all kinds. I promote fighters, place them in tournaments. Singled you out and venture to say you'll not regret that. 
Now, let's go where boys become men and brawlers become champions. The place right, reeks of blood, but come out hands. standing, and you oh, sense the sweet house. smell of horrors. What did he say? Halt! Don't recognise King Ziggy? I know you, but who's the other one? He looks dangerous. Like all of King Ziggy's fighters. Well, that farman you brought in last time was carried out all broken in no time. This one will be different. You'll see. The Commandant himself will bet a fortune on him. All right. But if I'm to let him in, he has to leave all his weapons here. Find another fool, Ziggy. Why? I'm giving you the greatest chance of your life. Oh dear, I'd best go drown. Here. I'm ready. The boys pull punching tricks, that's how they get their kicks. But hear me when I say, an orange a tiny price to pay. One more stunt like that and I'll die! Look at him, Corporal, sir. Got remorse on his face, he does. Seems eager to make amends for his crime and become a law-abiding citizen. Yeah, uh, that's true. Listen well, you lout. I don't believe you for a minute. But you'll escape the Reaper, this one... Nothing doing. Kill the bastard! Enjoy your meal. Make me the last one in this shit. Haven't you had enough? These fights aren't part. So what'll it be? Some of the punches lights out. Yeah. 
What does a bloody witcher actually eat? Uh, mushrooms? Spuds? Why spuds? Because he's a huge like us. The boys were punching tricks. That's how. When I say an orange a time, who does king? I'm ready. I'll explain. Spit it out. Know what Flotsam's famous for? Nothing. You're wrong there. There are only two towns worth visiting in the Pontar Valley. Bondar, famous for having the most beautiful hordes in the north, and Flotsam. For having the best fist fighting scene. Come on! Who organizes these fights? Officially, no one. But look hard and you'll be surprised what you can find. It's a vibrant scene with winners and losers of all kinds. I promote fighters, place them in tournaments, singled you out and venture to say you'll not regret that. Now, let's go where boys become men and brawlers become champions. The place reeks of blood. Smell of orange. Well said. There's a third. And his hand inched. Halt! This one, you'll see. Alright. Find a nut. Why? Oh dear. What then? He got a ball in the back. Too bad he turned out. Oh, 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 oh. The poor ones are always up at it. One more stunt like that and I'll kick you out. Look at him, Corporal, sir. Yeah, uh, listen well. And don't dare raise your hand at a soldier again!
A hero, eh? Halt! Don't reckon I'm I know like but I f this one you s alright. Fine. You're a rich man already. The weapons will be waiting in the trunk outside the gate. Burrito. In the flesh. Does he condone these fights? Condone? He sets them up. A lot of coin at stake here. I haven't been... You found me. Splendid. I dug through my coffers and happened... I don't need it, but a monster slayer... Thanks. A hero, eh? A hero, eh? <laughs> Wanna a dance hero, right eh? <laughs>
Wanna dance, white teddy? A hero, eh? Sock it to him! Ziggy the Clown returns. And in grand fashion. I've got a contender who's about to be famous. The Monster Slayer? How'd you talk him into fighting? King Ziggy has his ways. All in all looks promising. Stand your ground! We're about to make Flotsam famous for its mug fights. They'll sing songs about Ziggy and Geralt. You just win, and I'll take care of the rest. Ready? This isn't my... You promised to fight! Ziggy the Cla- and the- Sock it! We're about- Yeah, I'm right. Grand, I'll hear you say my name with- Twigs will be your- I love these pussies with- Finish the fucker off!
Stand your ground! Finish the fucker off! Ship belongs in the gutter. Those peasants beat you like a dog. Guess I let them. Wait, how, how would you know? I like to bet on a good knuckle fight once. As if... Hmm. Did they beat you up to... Worse. They've got this small Karen they keep in a glass jar. It predicts fight results. Apparently had a perfect record. Until today, that is. It indicated you with one of its tentacles, so that's how I bet all my coin. Landing. The monster. King Z. All in. Finish. We're about. Yeah. Grand twigs. I Stand your ground. Finish the fucker off! Sock it to him! Shit belongs in the gutter. Ziggy the Clown returns. And in grand fashion. I've got a contender who's about to be famous. The Monster Slayer? How'd you talk him into fighting? Finish the... Grand... Stand your ground! Sock it to him! Stand your ground! Sock it to him! Finish the fucker off! Beautiful job, rearranging his face. Who's next? One Punch Matha. Name says it all. Downs most opponents with his... I'll see if I... Good luck. Sock it to him! Finish the fucker off! Stand your ground!
Finish the fucker off! Shit belongs in the gutter. Finish the fucker off! Ziggy the... And in grand. The monster slayer. How'd you talk him? Kings. All in. We're about... Yeah. Grand. Twigs will... I love the... Stand your ground! Fuck it to him! Finish the fucker off! Stand your ground! It belongs in the gutter.
Stand your ground! Ziggy the Clown ret and Ink the Monster. King Ziggy at. We're about to make flops. Yeah, I'm grand. Twigs will be. Sock it to him! Finish the fucker off! Sock it to him! Finish the fucker off! Socket to him! Stand your ground! Beautiful job. Who's next? One punch math. Nine says it. I'll see if I. Good luck. Sock it to him. Finish the fucker off. Sock it to him! Stand your ground! Finish the fucker off! your ground! You're the discovery of my... Think we're made for... Indeed. Not too popular. He has tassels. Bring on this test. Sock it to him! Finish the fucker off! Stand your ground! Sock it to him! Finish the fucker off! Stand your ground! One more and we'll be rich and famous. Who is it? Stanek. In a rumble it... I'll do it. Don't underest. Socky! Witcher, come here a minute. It's impressive technique. Thanks. Last fight's coming up. And everyone's betting on the dead cert. You. Except for me. What do you want, Lerito? Stenek has to win. But the true winners will be you and me. A third of the jackpot's yours. And that's not an offer. 50-50 split. 
fine to show you my heart of gold. Just don't fail me. Finish the fucker off! Sock it to him! Stand your ground! Finish the fucker off! Pay up. Here's your coin. The guards will take you to the gate. You'll regret this. Stand I told you we'd win. I've got a real sense for... I think you owe me something. Why don't we have some fun first? A free... You can screw my share. What did he say? He said... This is nice. Yeah, but... What then? He got a ball. The poor ones are always uppity.
some help finally. I thought I was done for. I'm fine, but my friend remains in that... Cedric told me the two people went missing near the burnt mansion. I'm Rupert Brandhuber. I'm a medic from Edda, and I came here with a friend to look for a very rare species of herbs. These woods aren't the best place for herb picking. So we were warned, but the temptation was too great. We got as far as the site of the fire. No sign of herbs, but there was something downstairs. Something. What's that? Can you hear it? That's Grindley's dog. Feel that? Something approaches. Help us! Find my companion, I beg you. How many more can there be?
those here were innocents, and I... Four, twelve, fever, shakes, dilated pupils. Has there been any stories? Seven, involuntary cramps of the facial muscles. It's St. Vitus syndrome. He's dribbling. He's dangerous. Lock him up. <laughs> 